In this part of video, we will talk about battery and controller. These are the components which gives you that extra energy when you need the most. A full battery charge will give you up to 30 kilometers of mileage. Now let's learn how to replace battery and controller. Step 1. Remove Pedal Remove the pedal by rotating the spanner anti-clockwise. Step 2. Open chain cover. Open the chain cover by the help of screwdriver. Step 3. Remove front wheel. Loosen the quick release to release the front wheel from the fork. Step 4. Remove down tube cover. Remove the down tube cover with the help of a screwdriver. You need to loosen two screws to open tube cover. Step 5. Cut the cable ties. Cut all the cable ties with the help of a cutter. Step 6. Open the connectors. Open all the connectors including motor, display and throttle. Step 7. Loose the battery mounting screws. Loosen all the battery mounting screws to take the battery out. Step 8. Unmount charging port. In order to take the battery out, you need to unmount the charging port. Step 9. Remove rubber grommet. Remove both the rubber grommet carefully. One near battery cape. And another near the head tube. Step 10. Remove the battery and controller. Pull out the battery from the down tube and remove all the tapes on controller with the help of a cutter. Remove the controller from the battery by rotating the screw anti-clockwise.
Step 11. Check Fuse Please make sure that you also check the fuse on the battery and replace the same if needed. Step 12. Replace Controller Take the new controller and tighten it up with the help of screwdriver. Step 13. Wrap all the wires. Wrap all the wires and put the tape around it. Step 14. Put a wire or a rope inside the down tube from the other side. Now to put the battery back into down tube, you can put a wire or a rope inside the down tube from the other side. Step 15. Tie the wires with rope. Tie the battery wires properly so that we can pull the battery into the down tube. All the wires should be carefully handled avoiding any possible damage. Step 16. Battery Mounting Screws Mount the battery back by tightening both the screws. Step 17. Put the rubber grommet. Put both the rubber grommet back in place. Step 18. Put the charging port in the hole. Put the charging port in the hole and tighten it properly. Step 19. Connect the connectors. Now make sure all the connectors including motor, display and throttle are put back in place. For doing so ensure that the arrows are opposite to each other for avoiding any damage. Step 20. Cover the down tube with the end cap. Cover the down tube with the end cap by tightening screws on both sides. Step 21. Mount chain cover. Mount back the chain cover and tighten all the three screws properly. Step 22. Tie the paddle with spanner. 
mount the paddle and tighten it with the help of a spanner. Step 23. Mount the front wheel. Mount the front wheel and tight it with the help of quick release. Step 24. Tight all the cable with cable ties. Tie all the cables back with the help of cable ties.